What is up, my Squirtle Lights? It is I, your king. Welcome back to more Let's Play Forza Horizon 2. In the last episode, we began the GT Cars Tournament here in Nice. And in this episode, we're going to be continuing with the tournament. And with, or in the interest of transparency, I would like to make mention that I have turned the difficulty back down to the highly skilled setting. Um, just because, uh, more so for the sake of being able to actually get through things with relative consistency, not because it was undoable, but just because I don't want to be floundering around forever for just a plus 10% skill increase. Can you not push me around? That's That would be really great. Not to mention, highly skilled is still, it's still challenging for sure. It's just not, you know, near as difficult as it was when I was playing at the pro difficulty, but that's fine. Um, I, I can, I still am going to definitely get my money's worth out of these highly skilled races, and that plus 60% bonus is still fine. So, uh, yeah, I don't want to I basically don't want to spend like 45 minutes, okay, maybe not that long, 30 minutes recording every single episode when they really come out to like a little under 20. Uh, just having to do cuts and redos and all that kind of stuff. It's just for the sake of getting this Let's Play going and done. That's why I've turned it, tuned it down just a little bit, but I will still obviously be super embarrassed with driving like that, for instance. Um, so I need to, I'm definitely going to still try to put on like the best performance that I possibly can in every single race. Um, and... If need be, at some point I might crank the difficulty back up, but with this tournament in particular, I am struggling a lot trying to make it happen, so turned it down just a smidge, and uh, otherwise I still don't have the assists that I usually have, and we should be good to go. Really the only assist that I ever like to have on is um, ABS, just because I'm very bad at managing um, braking pressure when it comes to like wheel spin, uh, spinning out and stuff like that, so... Um, that's like the only thing that I usually like to keep on. I'm sure I could get used to it if I played for long enough with it off. Because um, it it does actually... I, I want to say it gives you like another 10% back if you drive without it. So I, I honestly need to like at some point just sit down and get used to racing without it. But it's like the one thing that I usually always need. Steering control, traction control, uh, rewinds. Honestly, none of that is really all that necessary. The only reason I have the braking lines on is just because I'm very bad at, like... I, I'm, I'm just very bad at, like, predicting exactly how I need to brake. If anybody watched my Midnight Club Let's Play, you would know that I'm pretty bad at that. And uh, don't want to be going careening into walls more than I already do. Especially because my terrible vision often makes me miss the lines anyway. Alright, there we go. And he was like right on my tail that entire time anyway, so I don't even know what I'm saying. That was that was still somewhat challenging. All right, there we go. So with that done, we now have just two races left to do in this tournament. And look at that. Still some good CR per race. I'll still take 10,000 with every single win. Some good experience. And almost another wheel spin. I don't care about the rival. Let's continue. Now, I'm not surprised that... I, I want to say that right now the game is just loading a bunch of, like, stock Drivatars. Um, because I can't actually get anything to load in this game at the moment, internet-wise. Uh, mostly because I'm downloading the Code Vein demo in the background. Oops. <laughs> and it's totally eating up all my bandwidth right now. So, right now, this game is just hopeless in the way of internet. So, let's do this next one. The circuit. Uh, the lo Sorry, the lone circuit here in the GT Cars tournament. Uh, of course, three laps is the way to go in these sorts of events. They're definitely my favorite. So here we go. Nice Vicenna, GT Cars, Circuit Race. And I do believe the other one we have is a sprint. So let's just do this thing. And here we go. All right, actually, I, real quick, I want to say, oh, because this is a little guy. This is a very little one. Shouldn't be too bad, though. I, I would assume it's... We're going to be going pretty slow throughout the mo most of this race. Now, I really like circuits just because... I mean, first of all, they're kind of honestly easy to exploit. But second of all, they're just... They're definitely just all about perfection a lot more than, this, uh, than the sprint races are. The sprints are more trial and error, I would like to say. Uh, so, you have, to, you have to basically just do the same thing over and over, but get it down perfectly. Which is definitely how I like to do things, so... Okay, that was really poorly done, and I lost my entire skill bonus deservedly because of that. Oh, thanks for the push, though. I will take that, even though I didn't earn it with that really poor driving display. All right, let's see if I can catch up here. Doing good, doing good. Here we go. We're starting to gain on everybody. Perfect. Let's use that. 
And then slow down here. Thank you. Pardon me. Make this turn. There we go. Take out a telephone booth. I don't even freaking care. Who's paying for all this, though, man? I mean, is the Horizon of, is the Horizon Festival... I mean, they've got quite the bill when it comes to the amount of stuff that gets damaged. Let's be honest. I mean, at least in Midnight Club, it was, like, justifiable under the fact that you everything you're doing is literally illegal. But this is a sanctioned event. Probably by the cities as well. Like, the... They obviously, I mean, it's this is this can't just be one giant illegal activity out in the open. This is clearly sanctioned for by the populace. I'm sure it's like one of those things where like all the money that goes into it is like good for the surrounding area because it's literally a festival. But also with how much crap we're damaging, that's going to be one heck of a bill that the Horizon Festival is going to have to pay for. So good luck with that turn 10. All right. That was actually a really good drift I got there. Right, let's keep going. Get that wreckage bonus up a little bit. And it looks like... Okay, I've got a really good lead this time, so I'm not too worried. But let's actually make this next... Uh, this turn that I screwed up royally earlier properly. There we go. Just like so. That was beautiful. I mean, honestly, it could have been even better if I would have not had to rely on the brakes so badly because I kind of broke uh, braked at the last second, which was not the most ideal thing in the world. Okay, that was an accident too far. I'm just adding to that bill, honestly. But you know what? They incentivize it, so I shouldn't even be mad. I mean, I guess I guess they are clearly prepared to pay for everything. Got myself another skill point. I actually need to spend uh, skill points here, which I will definitely do between races, um, because I've got, I believe I have five now, which is more than enough for anything I could possibly need. So we'll definitely worry about that once this race is over. Get this thing. There we go. Uh oh, slow it down a little bit. There we go. Beautiful. Okay. Oh, geez. Bench is going flying. And not to mention all the freaking. I mean, just the the damage to the cars alone is got to be like a ton for the Horizon Festival because, whoo boy, these are some nice and expensive cars. It's okay though. They just pay for it all in credits. What am I talking about? With the, with the amount of money Microsoft gets in microtransa microtransactions, they should probably be fine and able to pay for everything anyway, am I right? hey -oh. No, but for real, though. Wait a minute. Trash man? But that wasn't a trash can. That was a phone booth. Unless you're saying that there was somebody in there and you're calling them trash, in which case that's not very nice. And that probably hurts. That, that would hurt their feelings if they weren't dead. I'm, I'm sure. Also, I'm driving very poorly now. But not being punished for it, so I guess I can't complain too much. Maybe turning down that difficulty was a bad idea. I don't know. I didn't do the circuit race, but I was having a really hard time getting through the sprint races. And maybe this game just needs to be a little bit more consistent, consistent on its difficulty spectrum. Maybe that's what needs to happen. Because, yeah, this has been a very, very easy race. Like, I'm racing very poorly and still, like, absolutely crushing it right now. Take a, another one. For some reason, the pole was an ultimate wreckage. Okay. I mean, I'll take it, but I don't know how that was any better. Take out a couple rubber cones, I suppose. There we go. Yeah, let's just finish this darn thing off. Just on the final stretch now. Can I beat my time from last lap? Probably not. Got 11 seconds. Here we go. We're going. We're going. Can I do it? Uh, it doesn't look like it. Yeah, no. I'm not, I'm not going to do it. I'm not going to do it. Kind of close, though, but not close enough. And there we go. Nice one, mate. You looked in control for that whole race there. Yeah, I mean, I, I won by like a full, um, like four and a half seconds, so eh. really wasn't all that difficult. Okay, we got one more ahead, and like I said, I'm going to be using a skill point. We're also going to get a wheel spin after this because I will definitely have enough speed. Holy CR! That was ridiculous. Did you see that? My goodness. No idea why that race was worth so much, but let's spin for a prize here. See if we can get something good. Come on, come on, come on, come on. You, that's interesting. A Ford S200 Evolution. It's worth quite a lot, too. I will absolutely take that. Okay, no, wrong menu. Let's go to our progress menu and take a look at our perks. Let's see what we got. Okay, so, what was it? Permanent 10% discount on all, yes, that's the one I want. Okay, so we got that. So now, the only other major perk we have left is Skill Legend. Your Skill Multiplier can go to 6, which is pretty darn nice. Although, that's very hard to get um, in most scenarios. If you're actually, like, 
perk farming, then it's then it's actually very useful. But in most scenarios, getting it up to a time six is ridiculously difficult. Okay, so extra 25% uh, XP from bank skills and free roam, 10% more XP from club bonuses. Just, yeah, that's, we're not even going to use that. Uh, I'm not going to use that. Permissive temp. Okay, that actually might be useful. Let's see. E drift skills. I should definitely go for that one next. Tuning and paint downloads. Skill chain builds right. Okay, that's probably the next one to go after. So we'll go after that one and the e drift skills. And then maybe a fast travel anywhere after that. Although that's not like the most useful thing in the world because of how little fast travel I'm actually doing in this. Uh, so far, I've only fast traveled, I believe two or three times this entire let's play this far and okay yeah that's like 20,000 credits I could have saved but it's still like not that bad so let's get over here and finish this thing and then we'll call it a video excuse me wait what do you talk what do you mean turn around it's right here jeez shut up woman <laughs> sorry <laughs> that was incredibly misogynistic of me I mean well I, is it really though when it's just a GPS I don't freaking know I guess it was the tone. <laughs> Yikes. Okay, Nice Macena GT Cars. We're at last sprint race. Here we go. Let's do this thing. I was really struggling on this one when I had it on the higher difficulty, so I'm going to just leave it at what it was at. And here we go. I don't even need to win it, honestly. But here we go. All right, Rafa, Rafa Kra I almost said something I didn't want to say there. Just trying to pronounce that that Gravatar's name. My goodness. Rafa Kraus. All right, that was a good clean start, though. And then here we go. All right, let's slow it down a little bit. Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. We're good. We're good. All right, let's get an ultimate pass going. There we go. Doing good. All right, let's use that to our advantage. Ooh, whoa, easy now. All right, there we go. Got an ultimate pass. Triple, ooh, triple pass. I'll take that. Got some wreckage bonuses there. Don't hit that tree. All right, here we go. Can I get some drafting in, maybe? Doing pretty good. It's, oh, it's starting to give it to me. There we go. There we go. Doing awesome. Got that awesome drafting bonus. Oh, excuse me, sir. Whoa, easy, easy, easy there. Okay, got a good skill bonus. I need to pass these guys. Oh, don't you dare push me off course, you piece of crap. Get out of my way, Madison Marie. Who do you think you are? I mean, other than Ma obviously Madison Marie, that is that is very clearly their name. All right, we're just behind three of them. I had to scratch my neck there really quickly, and I had to do that in a hurry, otherwise I was gonna get myself into a bad position if I wasn't careful. Okay, we're good. We're good. We're good. Woo! Thank you for that. Oh, that was beautiful. Woo! All right, that's a that's one way to use somebody, and not in the Kings of Leon way. Get over there we go i want to be on this side there we go we're good we're good we're good oh yeah that was beautiful look at that Woo! all right now we just got to maintain it yeah i'm definitely doing a lot this is this is panning out a lot better than it was earlier like you can see i mean i I'd str i struggled to get into first place that was actually some pretty darn good racing night there to get into first place so turning that up another difficulty level probably would have been uh yeah, no joke, and I wasn't really in the mood to put up with that. Okay, I slowed down a little bit too much there. Okay, we need to go. We're right at the end. Home stretch. Here we go. GT Cars tournament complete. Thanks, man. All right, so we're not going to get near as much CR that time because that was a shorter race. Yeah, you say that every single time, but we need to win six more championships. Got some good CR rewards, some good experience rewards. Not enough for another level, but that is it for that one. And yeah, I might as well like the design. That was the last championship of this road trip. If you're done in Nice Messina, meet back at the hub and we'll head back to the festival for the awards party. Well, I will definitely set a waypoint there and we'll be driving on our way back, but... We're not going to do anything there until the next episode. So, ladies and gentlemen, that is going to be it for this episode of Let's Play Forza Horizon 2. I hope you all enjoyed it very much. In the next episode, heading on another road trip, picking another car, starting another tournament, all that good stuff. We're probably going to do some bucket lists before we actually jump into any races, though. So, uh, with all that said, thank you all so very much for watching. I hope you all enjoyed this episode of Let's Play Forza Horizon 2 very, very much. And I will see you all in the next one.